I'm Osh Katz, Chairman of the Board of the Harry and Rose Sampson Family JCC. This week's Torah portion, Re'eh, or C, is probably one of my favorite ones. There's a special portion in it that brings me here with my buddy Sam to tell you a little story about what this, what's behind the Torah portion. Re'eh is another long list of things we're supposed to do and not supposed to do. In fact, we're told, if you follow God's instructions, you'll live a full and happy life, and if you don't, you'll be cursed. Specifically, one of the instructions is the laws of kashrut and how to keep kosher, more specifically even, the laws of the slaughter. When we actually look into what the laws of slaughtering are all about, they're very specific. The knife can't have any nicks, it has, cannot have a pointed edge or pointed front. It needs to be a perfectly uh, clean knife so that, in fact, when you have to cut the animal or the animal's throat, you do it in as fast as possible manner and as kind of possible manner. The idea behind this is to give the animal as little pain as possible when you're killing it. In fact, there's a whole long discussion with whether you even need, need to eat meat in the first place, but as a vegan, I won't have that conversation. I can tell you that the idea of actually how we treat our animals, though, is rooted in our history and rooted in who we are. In fact, the idea of a humane society, in fact, is a Jewish society. The idea of Tzar Balei Chaim is one that starts with us in this Torah portion. The second part about the Torah portion, specifically that I like about the animals, though, is not only do we care for animals in the way we kill them, in fact, how we treat them as our own. Last week I got a wonderful email <coughs> from my friend Jody, Jody Habersinikin, sharing a wonderful video that's gone viral of a man floating with his dog who suffers with terrible arthritis. The dog actually is sleeping in his owner's arms. The notion being that, in fact, that's the best way for the dog to actually be, find comfort is in the water where his arthritis doesn't hurt. The idea is actually owning animals and caring for them and loving them is one way closer with how we can actually be with each other. Loving, caring, the kind of people we should be. That's Torah portion right ahead. Shabbat Shalom.